It's such a great event, and it's a wonderful way to meet new people and people that have been involved since the very beginning. Um, this is our 21st year for Party in the Kitchen. Very excited. We've got a great space to have it in. It's going to be different stations of chefs from different restaurants. We're very excited about Kevin and Peter being our chairs, too, and we're really hopeful of reaching a lofty goal this year and bringing a lot of money to help finance this worthy cause. I think Open Hand is an incredible organization um, whose mission is to help those who need um, specific uh, meal requirements from medical needs and um, certainly very effective in our community on that level. We serve over 5,000 meals a day and I think that's pretty spectacular. But my son, uh, he's a stroke patient. He's 44. He's 44 years old and as a mother and a caregiver, I'm speaking to all the caregivers out there, would you understand these um, meals that comes to your home where well, it takes care of a lot of things that you don't have to do. And that is, these meals are delivered at our door and I know I'm one that couldn't not leave the house. And that meaning is that my, my son is not bedridden, but also he's a seizure patient as well. So therefore, I can't leave the house like a normal person and go to the grocery store and pick up these items. So that's why I'm grateful. I understand it was started in the 80s because it really directly benefited a people who were living with AIDS and now it's just really expanded to beyond what we can imagine but the, the, there's so much need in our communities and it's serving everybody it's, but I think it really when you do something that's doing so much good in our city in our community in our state it really comes back to you a thousandfold.